and welcome back to Irish Football Fan TV. Hugh here at the SCF Electricity League launch day. I'm joined by Danny Grant from Bohemians. Danny, looking forward to start the season? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we've done well last year and hopefully we can kick on. Trying to do even better this year, actually. Had a decent pre season so far. I think winning every single game, getting plenty of goals and a 6 0 win over Wexford tonight. How do you think pre season's gone for yourself? Yeah, we've looked good there. Eh? I'd say we've looked decent there. Uh, everyone's got game points, you know, some big plays. Six, six games, so we all, we all started out playing 45 minutes and then everybody's played within two months. So, yeah. Big first game of the season, possibly the most exciting one for Buzz fans of the year against Shamrock Rovers. Um, you looking forward to that one? Yeah, you can't beat it really. You know, best game probably to kick off the year. Both teams be well up for any occasions. Big season last season, possibly exceeding everyone's expectations of getting third place and qualifying for that on a important European game. It's a new challenge for, for you as a player and as a player as well. Are you looking forward to that one European football? Yeah, it's a challenge, obviously, but it's a challenge that we all look forward to. You know, I don't think there'll be many of them, maybe Wardy and maybe one or two others who play in the European game, but the rest of the young lads obviously haven't. So it's a challenge that, that we're all looking for. In terms of the league, obviously you're quite a bit behind Rovers last season. And Dock obviously third place. How do you close the gap points-wise and bring that third to a second or a first season? It's going to be tough. You know, again we we've, we've done well. We've, we've kept a lot of our players. We're still going and eight or nine new players. So it's going to take a while. And it's kind of an unknown. It always is with young players. You don't know how it's going to go. But in Rovers, we know we're good. Rovers and Dundalk are there. Enough. We're still a good bit off then, you know, it's obviously good to get into the but we're still 15 points off the there's 20 something off the dog, so it's a big gap yeah, here yeah, for the region. Do you, think, um, do you think that game against Rovers last season semi final will be used as maybe extra motivation next Saturday to prove a point that Bowes can compete with the top teams they are there, thereabouts? Yeah, but you know what, it doesn't really matter, it's not about revenge, it's just another football game at the end of the day, but obviously there's a bit more on it. Keith Long's brought in a lot of new signs and mentioned they're second to go. Do you think that's to help maybe with the extra competition in European football and maybe help challenge for the league title? Yeah, it's going to be tough, you know, the I think before. You know, that, that mid-season break comes, we're playing in 30 games, probably between 25 and 30 games, so squad depth is, is a big thing, and we can be 26, 27 players, everybody will be important. Yeah. And in terms of the FA Cup, two semi-finals in the last two seasons, do you think it's it's supposed you to maybe get that Aviva Stadium day out? Hopefully, yeah. It's what we'll all be hoping, but, you know, at the end of the day, it's something. Cups are different leagues, and I just watch you every game. It's hard. I know we've been off there a few semi points in a row, and it's a bit hard to just, you know, hopefully we can go in better this year. Best of luck for the season, Danny. Appreciate that. Thank you.